am I doing this? Yeah. Oh. Oh, you just want to play. Is that even recording? Welcome to the very first channel. I am uh, socially awkward. <laughs> so I messed this video up uh, at least a thousand times. Um, because, you know, it's my first video. Hey everybody, so this is the very first video of what I hope will be our channel, For the Nerds. Um, I'm Ray, uh, and I never thought I would be involved uh, this deeply in YouTube, such as creating content, creating a channel. Um, but there are a couple reasons why I did this. Um, so a little about me, I am a Marine. Um, I currently work at Radio Shack as a technician, um, right next to Circuit City and Blockbuster. But I like what I do. Um, so people bring in, um, you know, their phones or their PCs, TVs, um, scanners, like anything uh, uh, that requires tech assistance, they bring it in. And if it's a software or hardware problem, we, we solve it and they leave happy. And then we usually teach them uh, some things so they leave informed. And I really love doing that. Uh, another thing about me, I am currently pursuing my bachelor's degree in computer information systems and cybersecurity. Uh, I have been going for over a year and a half now, taking two to three classes every six weeks. So it's a lot of school. It's a lot of school. What it really is, is a lot of research and studying. So I spent a lot of time on YouTube. I have watched tens upon tens of videos. Now, um, everybody knows that as a society, we basically live on YouTube and Google. What I've learned is there, there are quite a few channels and not all, um, because a few are really good channels. I, I go to them for a lot of my content, but when I do need to learn a specific thing and only a couple channels offer that specific thing, God bless you. That was my cat, Gemma. Our pets have to follow me around. They're like a little cloud anywhere dad or mom goes, they follow. Uh, so they're all in here uh, wondering what I'm doing. But no, what I was saying is I'll get on these channels and go to learn something and I'll spend six to sometimes 10 minutes before I get to the content that I clicked on, the meat and potatoes uh, of what I'm trying to learn. And when it is being taught, they backtrack or um, they mess some things up or, um, you know, it's just, it's not confident teaching and the steps are, seem like they're out of order. And then afterwards I end up simplifying it myself and that's what I don't like. There's a need for what I have in mind. Um, a channel where the community says, I want to learn this, or I want this simplified, or what do you think about this? And then we tackle that issue and we do it in such a way that we get right down to the subject matter of it and list the steps where, you know, I have to start doing this and then I can do this and this. And in the tech world, you can skip steps and stuff like that. But with some things, it's just easier having it simplified and, you know, steps one through five and then you're up and running and confidently too, where you know what you're doing. Uh, instead of, well, he wasn't confident or she wasn't confident or they weren't confident in teaching me. So I'm not, I'm not feeling too hot about this right now. I really feel like this channel can solve that problem, um, on everything tech topic, uh, be it operating systems. I'm going to go over, uh, installation, configuring and setting up, uh, windows, Mac, uh, Linux, particularly Kali Linux, virus removal, prevention. Uh, you know, virus, malware, adware, ransomware, um, being able to remove that stuff or prevent it uh, in as few steps as possible, um, I think would really help the community. 
moving on to hardware, PC builds, troubleshooting, um, soldering, micro soldering, cell phone repair, uh, be it screens and batteries. One of the things that I don't really like is that it's, you know, 2019 and we're paying somebody over $200 to replace a screen on one of your phones where it could only cost maybe 60 bucks. Uh, don't quote me on that, but I'm throwing out wild figures. You've had to probably replace a screen or a battery and get quoted a price and you're like, whoa, that is astronomical. Like, and you just feel sunken because if you knew how to do that yourself, you would feel more confident that you could go and purchase this and repair it yourself. So I'm a big advocate in uh, the right to repair. From software to hardware, I wanna cover it. Uh, you bring it up and we'll talk about it. We'll show videos on it. Uh, we'll come together as geeks, nerds, enthusiasts, uh, just normal people wanting something explained to them so that they can do it themselves. I want us to be able to do that together. Uh, this is for the nerds. I want us to say we did this. So I really feel like this is something that is needed in the tech community where it's not focused on one person, where the community feels like we came together and did this and helped ourselves out. As I was saying, I'm a Marine. I was in the infantry. We were, you know, we we're always uh, hearing like, oh, a dumb grunt. Um, you know, your head's only good for breaking through walls. Uh, and to an extent that's true, but a lot of people don't understand that in the infantry, especially in the Marine Corps, tragedy, we get put in the, some of the hottest zones and tragedy does strike. And if that guy with the radio, you know, gets hurt or even worse, we can't just say, well, I don't know how to do that. Like we have to know how to do that job to finish the mission. So we have to learn all the jobs around us, not just our own, so that if something does happen, we can still carry out the mission. There's no excuses. Um, and how we did that was we learned to adapt and overcome at an incredible rate. Uh, we would go to that person, ask them about their job, or we'd get formal training, and they would break it down in the most simplest way to its core, where we could learn that job and be up and running like that in as few steps as possible and as confidently as possible. So I've taken that from, um, from a extremely hardcore uh, scenario to my everyday life where if I need to learn something, I learn the basic core matter of it and go from there, like in as few steps as possible and build my foundation and then, you know, expand on that. I feel like we can do that together in this channel, break things down to as little steps as possible and be up and running. And I loved it best, uh, the quote by Einstein, if you can't explain it to a six-year-old, then you don't understand it. So we've all seen five-year-olds, six-year-olds with iPads doing stuff that we don't even understand how to do. And it's because they, they themselves break it down in as simplest as possible and know that if I click this, then this will happen. Or if I do this, then this will happen. So I want us to do that for this channel, be it five-year-old or 85-year-old come here to learn something, you're going to leave with confidence, knowing how to do that process that you were seeking out. If you like any of this, if any of this sounds great, um, you know, comment, like, or don't, but at least comment. Uh, let me know what you want to learn or what you want simplified or what you want explained. And I'll listen, we'll cover it. And even in the comments, if you see somebody asking about something and we haven't covered it, like, five years down the road or whatever, go back, explain it to them, be courteous, help each other. Yeah, if any of this sounds great, if any of this sounds like it could be for you, subscribe, help build this channel. Like, let's let's do this. Um, I'm excited about it. I'm gonna do everything I can to create this for all of us, for the nerds, um, you know, for the nerds. Uh, and we'll go from there. I'm really excited about this. I'm looking forward to seeing what we do together. So thank you uh, for listening and uh, let's see where it goes.